Hey guys, so Hogwarts Legacy. Hogwarts Legacy has now sold 15 million copies and made over 1 billion dollars. Uh, and just like the Mario movie, rightly so. Rightfully so. Uh, from what I've heard, it's a really good game. Uh, it kind of lets you live out your fantasy. You know, if you want to be a goody two shoes, you can do that. If you want to be a flat out freaking Death Eater evil, you can. Like the, like a lot of the the quests you do. Like I know one of the quests is like you have to retrieve something for some little girl in, from the lake, and you can choose to keep it. You can, you can choose not to give it to her, and that kind of affects things. So it's like, so you're going to keep it? Yes. If you wanted it so bad, you should have gotten it yourself. You're so mean. Yes, I am. <laughs> no, uh. So it, it apparently a really good game. People have liked it, and apparently so. Since it's made a billion dollars, um, it just goes to show that certain sides, uh, can't boycott. You know, they say that the left can't meme. The left also can't boycott. When they boycott, it gets more popular. You know, because, you know, people are going out when when the right boycotts. Well, look what's happening to uh because of Budweiser and, you know, Anheuser-Busch right now. Also, back when I was doing a more political channel, uh, Goya, like the beans, you know, you know, Goya. Uh, I think that it was the president and CEO of Goya came out in support of Trump. And so the left, of course, like, oh, my God, Goya supports Trump. <laughs> And then you know what happened? Shelves were being cleared completely of Goya products, not because of a boycott. You know, people were like, oh, they, we, no one wants to buy these. No, the right was going into these places, buying all of the Goya products, so much so that they had to put a limit, like four cans or whatever per person, because all the Goya products were just flying off the shelves. And just that insult to injury, the people who were buying it, most of them, weren't even doing anything with it they were actually donating them to like food kitchens and food uh you know food pantries and christian ministries so you have one side that says we're gonna boycott this and it gets more popular and then you have the other side where they boycott something and it actually has the desired effect we are not the same um so it's like the they're saying about oh we're gonna boycott the the, the, the Harry Potter TV show is like huh, yeah good luck with that it'll be about as as effective as a uh, boycotting uh, Hogwarts Legacy. Um, <laughs> boycott your boycott our boycott record number sales record breaking number of sales selling over 12 million copies globally within the first two weeks of release. The game ranks among the fastest selling titles in recent memory. In statistics revealed by Warner Brothers Games, uh, the company reported a, over 850 million in global sales in the first 14 days after launch. And then you have Anheuser-Busch. <laughs> and you just see, you, we are not the same. Um... <laughs> so Elden Ring is better wizard game than this or sure. game of the year I'm I'm pretty sure it is lined up to be like at least nominated for a game of the year uh, <laughs> I'm gonna shriek and I'm waiting to see it oh yes all those delicious tears great game can't wait for some DLC I know I know they're not making any are you sure they're not? I mean, I don't know why they wouldn't make any. The buzz has died down for me as it's taken so long for it to be released on the PS4. Damn, that boycott really did something, didn't it? Oh yeah, it did something, all right. It did something. Oh, what? But the slacktivists were so effective. Uh-huh. PC version still buggy, but good. Yeah, I heard there's a lot of bugs 
uh, that have yet to be squashed. Uh, like before, you know, something about items disappearing or uh, if like with certain chests that you know you get in you could get in the beginning of the game if you forget and you go back apparently it's supposed to kind of like scale up but instead it was you know basically when you if you lose something it's like robe right it'll pretty much be whatever level you were supposed to find it i guess uh and people were saying well isn't it supposed to scale up you know when you get stronger so therefore stats or whatever is be better uh so i'm ready for some dlc yeah i mean i don't know why you wouldn't have dlc or some kind of expansion i mean that would be really stupid to not do that <laughs> everyone boycotting it <laughs> everyone boycotting it worked then uh-huh why is there no celebration like this uh like there was for the last of us 2 because the last of us 2 sucked no one liked that game that's because it's very good. Who would have thought? <laughs> exactly. Who would have thought? The woke, the woke Twitter mob seeing this news. Such a good game. Uh huh. Uh huh. Yeah. The bo yeah. Pretty much most people are like, yeah, that boycott was real effective. Oh, that was really effective there, guys. So go ahead and boycott the, the TV series all you want. Um. <laughs> yeah. Seems like the boycott really did cancel J.K. Rowling. Uh huh. The boycott is really effective. Uh, I need the game. This game is sell more. I have a bet on it, and if I lose, I have to play the worst game of 2023. <laughs> Thanks to the amount of PR the game received, good stuff. I like the game. Need finish story. Need finish story. Game sucks. Fetch quest homeworks ruin it for me. Well, I mean, they can't all be super duper. I mean, look at like the MMORPGs that are out. We're still doing stupid fetch quests or like start. You go to an area, you talk to an NPC. You're like, oh, uh, go give this letter to that guy over there. It's like, do it yourself. Here's here's ten silver to do it. Ah, oh, whatever. <laughs> And then you go talk to the guy. Oh, well, I have a letter for him. Go. It's like, you guys are like literally 10 feet apart. Just. Why is it even a letter? Why don't you just talk to each other? Uh, coworker told me this game bombed hard. Yeah, well, apparently it didn't. Oh, yeah, this dude, how not to boycott. Ooh. Spent all that money on freaking uh, collector's edition just to do that. <clears throat> Joke's on you. Someone still gets that money. Good. The experience was amazing. I mean, most people were like, yeah, it's a really good game. Still bugged. Animal Crossing better? I mean, you can't really compare Harry Potter to Animal Crossing. They're two totally different games I mean there is no magic in Hogwarts Legacy just want to remind you that this exists oh I love the fox wired when was this a game in a, is mid at best and it's real world harms are oh god let me guess it causes very real harm to people of trans identity. <laughs> Helps me say goodbye to the setting for. The story is rooted anti Semitic. Uh, God. Really? Yikes, y'all. This. This is why people don't like um, gaming media anymore. Game would be harmful to the trans community. This is why people, you know, stuff like this and Polygon and Kotaku 
and all these other outlets, even if they're news of uh, gaming news or not, why no one takes them seriously? Because they've got to add their own personal political agenda into it. Instead of looking it through a lens of a fan, they're looking like, eh, uh, is, is, it, is it mean to certain groups? And eh, if you support it, the trans people are literally dying if you buy this game. <laughs> But, well-deserved, fantastic game. Yeah, and I hope it goes on whenever the other versions get released. Uh, I think Switch is still yet to come out, the, the version for the Switch. And I hope it makes even more. I hope we see this game not, uh, up for Game of the Year or actually winning Game of the Year. After all the crap that people were doing to try to shut this game down and boycott it. Um, so, it, 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 I'm glad it made over a billion dollars because, you know, like I said, it, 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 it was the kind of Harry Potter game that people have wanted for a long time. Because when you look at all the other Harry Potter games, they're pretty streamlined games. You know, it, it, they, some of them give you this idea of this expansive, or not expansive, but like open world, but it's still pushing you in a general direction. Um, there's still the story you have to follow, and if you wander off, it's like, well, nothing else really happens because the story won't, you know, you can't do anything. It's like, oh, what's this room? I'm sure it has something to do with the story, and yeah, what do you know? You know, you, you have to progress through the story for that room or whatever to become meaningful, you know? But apparently with this, you just can kind of do what you want. You have the quest from other people. You can choose to help them or, you know, you, you help them. But then, like I said, you can kind of keep whatever item. Uh, and just be a complete dick to the students, you know. Flip them in the air and just have them. You know, you can, if you wanted to be a Death Eater, now, now's your chance to be one. Because nothing is more dangerous than a Hufflepuff Death Eater. It's about time we, we start making the rules around here. Hufflepuff's been kicked around for far too long. It's always about Gryffindor and Slytherin, and even Ravenclaw gets more respect. The Hufflepuffs have been held down for too long, and we're tired of it. We're going to show everyone what the Hufflepuff really is. The honey badgers and honey badgers just takes what it wants, which is what Hufflepuff should have been doing all this time. And as a Death Eater, you can you can just take what you want. Bring bring glory to the house of Hufflepuff, or something. I don't know, but yeah, four billion uh four billion one billion dollars made for Hogwarts Legacy. Um, like I said, I think the Switch version is still to come out. So probably make more. Uh, so congratulations. Um, you know, people try to try to boycott. They tried to spoil the ending of the game and this and that. And it failed every single time. Every single time these people try to boycott something, they fail. So we are not the same. Anyway, that's going to do it for me. You guys know the drill. I'll see you guys later. Bye, guys.